seem realistic uh, back then. You know, when she was born, I was seven years old, you know. I was watching professional wrestling. I was big on wrestling, and I became uh, an interviewer of professional wrestlers. And uh, I did virtually everything I could potentially do um, with professional wrestling. And now, um, you know, we've crossed over in the last uh, number of years, and we're covering entertainment, too, uh, with news feeds, uh, talking about entertainment. We've had entertainment guests, and we've done stuff. Uh, for kids shows in the past and this is our latest contribution to the world of kids shows you can check out their website theslap.com for additional details they're definitely going to be talking about that I noticed why TV have killed uh, the Friday promotional uh, commercials that ran for about 30 seconds uh, because the show's now been bumped from just the weekend thing uh, on YTV at least not too sure about Nickelodeon they'll probably improve it with season 3 uh, but here in Canada now you can see this thing Monday to Thursday, you get to relive your favorite Victoria Justice moments. It is incredible. Hit her up on Facebook, Twitter, and her official YouTube channel, uh, which I believe is youtube.com slash Victoria Justice for all, the number four, and uh, all, and you'll be able to pull it up with uh, some videos and stuff. She consistently tweets, and, and one thing about Victoria Justice is that she's so fan-friendly. You know, I've never seen a celebrity communicate with her fans as much as what she does. You know, she doesn't lie when she says you're provided with an opportunity to connect with her via the slap.com or her YouTube channel or her Facebook. It doesn't matter who you are. Um, she responds to you in such a positive way and always has a positive message to really lift your spirits. You could be in the dumps and this person could literally lift your soul and make your heart feel like it has wings. So, I want them to look at this thing that we've done for them as a gift to their show and a form, if anything, to show shows like Drake and Josh, iCarly, who've been around for years, um, that they belong where they are and they're in a position that they're very deserving of being in. Uh, I hope years down the road we see Victoria Justice mature and we see her land more TV deals, more movie deals, have a better show than what she's got now although her show right now is really decent, really wonderful, and uh, is appealing to all kinds of different age groups, not just uh, people between the ages of five and six years old. Um, and I have to tell you this, the reason I am supporting these kids' shows as much as I am, not just because I like these shows and because they've given me a reason to smile uh, for the first time in years since uh, circumstances have befallen me, everything from my mother dying, uh, to things happening in my life beyond my control that I've written about for my columns and stuff. Um, not because they've just given me an opportunity to smile, but because these are the stars, no matter if you like it or not, uh, that are going to be here ten years from now, that are going to be in movies, that are going to be doing something incredible. And it's just, I believe in it so much that I want to give these guys the form to be known, to be talked about, and to feel like they've accomplished something early in their life. And if you actually Wikipedia some of these guys, everyone from Danielle Mont to uh, Matt Bennett, you'll find an incredible list of accomplishments that they've done so early in life. And that says a lot of how far these guys can go. And I really think the entire cast of Victorious deserves an incredible amount of credit. Uh, they don't get enough credit. Victoria Justice is someone who I can never put over enough as someone who doesn't get enough credit, who deserves credit, who doesn't deserve to be criticized. I might have seen two or three Victoria Justice interviews on YouTube. We need more interviews. We need to get her on more, uh, you know, bigger platforms, even if she's not ready for them. Um, and I really think that credit is a huge thing that definitely uh, needs to befall uh, all of these Victoria Justice stars. Uh, these, these Victoria stars are incredible, and uh, I, I really don't think they get enough credit. So hopefully this little gift uh, we are giving them, uh, from the show HEW Entertainment Radio and the fans of the show who listen to us via our YouTube channel, our Facebook and our Twitter will benefit them. And uh, I'm not sure how long it's going to last, but uh, you know, as the old saying goes, uh, enjoy things while they last because nothing lasts forever. And uh, definitely, I'm sure a lot of fans are enjoying this. And one of the things I mentioned uh, in the letter that I sent off to YTV was that I'm sure that uh, the ratings are going to benefit uh, from this and the uh, fans of Victorious are going to be uh, absolutely overwhelmed and compelled, if anything, uh, to watch this show. One of the things I mentioned in the letter here, uh, before we wrap things up, is that I believe that a child who was a fan of Victoria Justice did not need to wait an entire week 
what YTV was doing here was they were obviously conserving uh, the limited amount of shows that they have. They've always had a working relationship with Nickelodeon uh, over the years, but Nickelodeon hasn't distributed all of the shows uh, to YTV uh, because they want you to subscribe to this channel. You have to pay a great deal for uh, to see Nickelodeon programming if you don't get YTV in your area. Some people are that unfortunate that they don't have either YTV or Nickelodeon. Um, YTV would make you wait. This is what they would do. they make you wait an entire week to see a show without commercials that runs about 22 minutes in entirety. That's the entire length of the show, 22 minutes in length. They would make you wait an entire week uh, for a 22 minute long show without commercials. With commercials you get the full half hour. They shoot the show for about 22 minutes and YTV was making you wait an entire week. I believe, with all due respect to that company, that network, uh, that I've followed my entire life, which is something else I mentioned in the letter, I believe that a child should not have to wait 20, uh, 7 days to see a 22 minute long program that they probably seen two weeks ago. It's not fair to them. And that's something that I believed, uh, with all due respect, was completely unacceptable. And that's why I initially wrote the letter. To get them a better time slot, to give the fans of the show what they needed to see. They need to see the show distributed more, if anything. I mean, memorable guest appearances from a lot of the stars of Victoria, on iCarly, doesn't do these guys justice. I mean, it's so early in their careers for them. They have a lot to, to accomplish yet. But if they're not provided with the promotional form to do it on, then they're not going to accomplish half of what they want to by the time they reach the age of 25. I, I, I think that this is, this is what they need, and I hope they can keep it. And I do wish all of them uh, the best of luck, and I hope that you can continue to join us as we continue to promote this. Uh, as we, as a show, in conjunction with YTV, uh, promote this thing and distribute it for you. And we are pleased to be working with them and the show, Victorious, in an effort to promote it. And I do wish uh, them all the best and hope uh, when this is all said and done, they remember who, they, who we are as fans, uh, who I am as a radio show host, and uh, have definitely put their dreams in action and made everything they do shine because that's what the show encourages you to do isn't it you know put your dreams in action anything is possible but then again every teen idol does that but uh, Victoria's definitely does it in their own little unique way over 40 of these shows have been produced from seasons 1 to 2 uh, with uh, 19 for season 1 12 for season 2 with a Christmas special and a couple of new premieres for the show which you probably can't there a while back they showed uh, The Breakfast Bunch. You can see that show in its entirety on our Twitter page. You can also see the Christmas special, a couple of tweets back, uh, called The Tory Christmas. And they've already released a full list of shows for Season 3, which I would assume is going to be on the Friday specials uh, periodically at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, with the Monday to Thursday uh, time slot, a better time slot than they initially were given, uh, the time slot they had, 2.30 a.m. Eastern Time, completely unacceptable. They've been bumped out of that, um, and it's it's great. The Monday to Thursday is going to be used for uh, repeats of some of your favorite Victoria Justice shows, and there are a lot of them in there. One of my favorites is Begging on Your Knees. I saw that one this morning. I like the very first one where she sang Make It Shine, the piano version, which is an incredibly beautiful version of that song. Um, I, I like the one where they debuted the song You're the Reason. Uh, the one where they were caught in a trailer during a massive heat wave and became completely overcome. Uh, so many creative ideas. The people who come up with these shows are absolutely unbelievable. And you can see it all now on YTV. So the only thing left for you to do is watch the show 8.30 Eastern Time. And I can't stress enough, give this show the ratings it needs to succeed and go above and beyond the expectations of anyone and make this show feel like it has a heart with wings because unbelievably uh, these guys have done it, they've deserved it and I want them to think of it as a gift. So to wrap the show up I'd like to uh, offer our thanks to YTV. Uh, this hasn't gone unnoticed. Uh, we definitely do appreciate it and uh, we'll continue to promote it. 
uh, until the novelty wears off on it at least and we have something new uh, to talk about when it comes to uh, either Victorious or YTV. Definitely uh, they've been providing good quality family programming for years. Uh, over the last decade, ever since I could remember they had been. And uh, I just hope that they continue to do the same thing because they have provided us with so many memorable moments. Uh, good family quality programming. So I want you to check your cable uh, and satellite provider listings for time and availability to catch Victorious. Definitely, it's 22 minutes in length without commercials. Download them via torrents if you don't get it in your area. Uh, you'll enjoy it. It's a show that your entire family can watch, appealing to all different age groups. The age demographic that this show appeals to is absolutely unbelievable, and I think that everybody, uh, in particular people between the ages of 6 and 13, are really going to love this one. And um, I'm putting it on a platform that I think it's deserving of being on. I've said this for the last six editions of the show uh, that we've done. This is our sixth edition of the show dedicated to Victorious and Victoria Justice, and uh, we're doing this to promote uh, the new time slot that we have been fortunate enough to get for these guys, and uh, I, I really think that they are going to go above and beyond the expectations of anybody. So congratulations to the cast of Victorious. I'm Jonathan Clark. Tell us what you think on our Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter page, where you can hear the show in its entirety, no matter if you're a friend of us on Facebook, if you are following the show on Twitter, or listening to us on our YouTube channel, tell us what you think, why don't you? Uh, throw up your links to photos, uh, characters you created for the video games, GFXs. Uh, I want to see them. Throw them up on our Facebook wall, throw them up on our Twitter page if you're following us on Twitter. If you subscribe to our YouTube channel or you aren't subscribed, leave us a comment even if you aren't. Uh, and uh, give Victorious the support it needs and give them the ratings it needs, even if uh, you watch it once a week at 8.30 Eastern Time, uh, definitely contribute to Victorious in your own little unique way because every little bit helps. Uh, and I, I hope that uh, you definitely support the show the way we have. This is our sixth edition of the show on Victorious and uh, definitely uh, join us as we uh, make an effort to put the dreams of Victorious and all of you in action. Until I talk to you again next week, follow me on Twitter at HGW Entertainment Jonathan Clark one uh, join the conversation on our Facebook page, new URL, facebook.com slash Entertainment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com, Jonathan Clark 22, where you'll find all of our victorious.